Hi, I'm Mike Holt with Mike Holt Enterprises. I've been training instructors since 1975 and I've been requested to kind of put together some little video programs to help the instructor be able to manage the class and to do the best they possibly can. Now, I got a series of questions that have been presented to me and let me just take one at a time. Ready for this? Mike, how do you handle questions from students who are obviously behind in the material and holding up the pace of the class for the other students who are prepared to move forward. You know, it's really difficult being an instructor under the best of conditions. And then you have students who have been motivated, who have been studied. You have students who have not motivated, have not studied. You have students who are motivated, who have studied, and they just, they're just struggling with the material. So how would I handle students that are asking questions in the class that clearly behind the class I would do a little preparation in advance. Number one, I would take the sharpest student in the class and I would assign them to those students that care, that really want to know, but they're a little bit behind. This keeps the student who's sharp, uh, who's maybe getting bored, it gives them a task, a project, it motivates him, it shows him how to help other people with the gift that he has, and it has that student be able to get that one-on-one. -on -one. Of course, I would get with the student also, but in the middle of the class, we probably wouldn't have that scenario because that student would be asking his buddy, hey, what did he mean by that and how come? So there'd be a little bit of discussion between the two of them at times. And we want to make sure that discussion is not in a way that's distracting. So that would be a tip that I would suggest on how to get a student who's behind in the class asking questions. I hope you enjoyed that little tip. If you have any suggestions how to make it better, you're welcome to email me, mike at michael.com. God bless, and I hope that this little video tip will help you do a better job with your students.